The more you are seen, the less you are valued. You will appear one day and disappear the next. Create mystery. The more you are around, the more people take you for granted. They become accustomed to your presence and start to see you as ordinary. But when you disappear, they are left wondering what happened to you. They start to think about you more and they begin to value you more. Of course, you don't want to disappear for too long. If you do, people will forget about you. They will move on to someone else who is more available. So make sure to strike a balance between being seen and being unseen. The key is to make people wonder about you and make them think about you when you're not around. You have to make them want to see you again. If you can do that, you will have mastered the art of absence. But be careful. If you disappear too often, people will start to think you're up to something. They will start to wonder if you're hiding something and if you're not careful, they will start to investigate. So use absence wisely. Use it to create mystery and intrigue. Use it to make people want to know more about you, but don't use it too often or you will lose their trust. Let's look at this example. Um, there was a dedicated and hardworking employee named Jake. He worked tirelessly, often going above and beyond the call of duty to ensure that his company met its goals and objectives. Despite his best efforts, however, Jake felt as though his contributions were not being fully recognized or fully appreciated by his colleagues and superiors, determined to earn the respect and honor that he deserved. Jake decided to try a different approach. He began using the power of absence to make his presence felt more strongly at work. Instead of always being available and constantly taking on new tasks, Jake started prioritizing his workload and taking time off when he needed it. He would also turn down certain projects if he felt they were not aligned with the goals or if they were not the best use of time and talents. Over time, Jake's absence became a powerful tool for increasing his respect and honor at work. His colleagues began to take notice of his contribution and the impact that he was making. They started to value his time and expertise more highly and sought out his opinion and advice on important projects and issues. Even his superiors began to recognize his efforts and accomplishments, and he was eventually promoted to a leadership position within the company. Well, in the end, Jake's decision to use absence as a means of increasing his respect at an honor at work paid off in his favor. By strategically managing his workload and prioritizing his time, he was able to make a lasting impact on his company and earn the recognition that he deserved. If you aren't respected by your by friends or by people, use this tactics and you will thanks me later. Subscribe me now or you will never see me again.